You like my dress? So, um, <laughs> I'm straight up wearing a box, y'all. A uh, couple things quickly. First of all, um, I have like about three months to do this. So I have like no makeup on. I'm in my bathroom. My bathroom's a mess. My kid's first day of school today and I have to run them to their tutoring literally in two minutes. So this is going to be really fast. Um, but I made this box from Amazon um, to show what Garcelle was wearing on stage. Did anyone else feel like it was a flipping box? Now if I had more time, I would have cut out a bigger neck hole so it could have fit me properly and I would have sprayed it black. So um, that was horrible. That was host awful. Off of my hand. All right, real quick recap. In one word, the whole show, meh, meh. The host, meh, brought no life. The music, blah. Um, there was no background packages on the girls. There was no reason to like vote for a girl of like, oh, look at her up right until the very end, until what was it, like the top five or something. Final look, it was final look when the girls came out and they were finally like, oh, let's tell you a little bit about her. Um, also, the final walk for Savannah's gown, first of all, she was stunning. Her gown was flawless, but there was no voiceover. Usually when they walk, they're like, I want to thank these people and this person and my sister queen and none of that. So what was that? Also, can we talk about the winner's bouquet for a second? We were like, that's her bouquet. Like you could get better at Costco, Kroger, Trader Joe's. She could, they could have spent $6 and gotten her a better bouquet. Um, all right, super quick, everything else, oh, y'all, what was this? The hair flicks. So my thoughts are, they were like, okay, everyone, we want like, first of all, oh, let's actually just talk about the hair. Damn it. Y'all, I need to go. This is good. I have so much to say in so little time. Um... I feel like the hair was very like old school pageantry. It was just too big overall. Like a lot of it was teased and there were so many curls and so much pieces, hair pieces. There's nothing wrong with our hair people. Why do we have to do hair pieces? Um, and I feel like the, whoever the was doing the hair makeup was like, we want like loose and beautiful and like, feel free to like play with it on stage. Cause every girl was like, as she walked off stage. That was just weird. Um, the capes with the bejeweledness, I was like, did they get them on Timu? Because there's a way to do that that looks good. And then there's Timu. So that had some problems. Also, Layla coming out talking on camera in her little pink blazer for so long. I was like, did Paula Shugard ever? show face like that or was she just always sitting in the audience looking classy did she have to take her 15 minutes of fame i don't think so just saying people just saying um the announcement of the top anything there was too much of a delay and next joining our top 20 is kentucky i was like like right there, if you just make that shorter, we could have had some performers, something that's interesting and pretty and fun. Also, I didn't like, now granted, I was drinking a lot of wine, so this may have happened, but I don't think that um, they had the swimsuit presentation and the evening gown presentation that comes out before the girls actually compete. Like all the girls who don't make the top 20 or don't make the top whatever, that they, they all come out so we get to see their gowns and do the presentation. Or did they have it? They might have had it. They might have had that. I don't know. I will drink the wine. Uh, so much to say about the gowns. Uh, oh, first of all, swimsuit. California has the best presentation in swimsuit, in my humble opinion. Did not make top 10. Kind of shocked about that. Because if they're literally moving on just on their swimsuit body and presentation. Um, I can smell my mom making dinner right now. Um, my parents are in town too, which is why I need to go. Oh, y'all, I am... I am so over. Okay, um, I could I could go on about the dresses. There's some that I love, some I didn't love. Reasons, all this stuff. I'm not gonna go into it. Um, best gowns, in my opinion, were Virginia, Hawaii, and Tennessee. 
Um, I was very surprised that in the top five, uh, Virginia or Mass didn't make it in. Um, oh, I thought Tennessee. So out of the top five, um, obviously Michigan was the winner. She had her hands on top. Which, by the way, little fun fact. Does anyone know that I am actually the one who started that whole thing? I was the first one. Lord have mercy. Who knows when? Uh, it was before I won Miss USA. So it was before 2004. So back when dinosaurs roamed the land. Um, but I noticed it and I made that comment, which is why at Miss Universe, little fun event, when it was me and Jennifer Higgins, we were holding hands and I was like, oh, my hands are, I was like, yeah. And then she would like turn her hand over and I was like, hey, okay. <laughs> I kept trying to get my hands on top. <laughs> um, so she had a great answer. She tied it to herself. Um, but if it was up to me, um, so first of all, if the top five is actually judged on their answers, I thought that Kentucky and Tennessee should have been out first. Um, instead, Ohio was the first one out and I thought she had a great answer. Um, but if it was up to me, if I was judging, I would have possibly, well, actually, I don't know. Cause you're supposed to judge in the moment, but I feel like if Tennessee had walking lessons, um, I think she could be Miss Universe for sure because she had that like striking presence. Um, but she definitely need just some fine tuning walking lessons. Otherwise I was like, she could go far. Um, so yeah, y'all pageant was meh. And I, it made me sad. I was like, is this the beginning of the end? Which I feel like we've been saying that for a while. But damn it, we just need some good blood in there who's like, I'm not gonna make this about me. I'm not the one competing. And get it back to its roots. Bring on a couple stage performances that aren't about them. It's about the girls, but it's just good music. Not listen to elevator music. Um, it's just guys, anyway. But, didn't y'all love my box? I legit was like, I ran in the kitchen. I was like, mom, can you make the boys food real quick? And she's like, what are you doing? And I was like, I'm making an outfit. <laughs> I'm like cutting it out. <laughs> and then they came in and I was like, I was like, all right, this will work. Grant hers was a little wider. But those, both the hosts, the, and Garcelle, I love that woman. I love her on Real Housewives. She's so real and honest. I think she's a fantastic mother, the way that she parents. But the wardrobe, y'all. Anyway, on that note, I hope y'all have a great day. Sorry for coming on here without having my hair curled. I don't even think I brushed it today. So that's what you get. That's what you get when you're a mom and a farmer. That's what I do now. A farm. Goodbye.